by the offline engine. Anyway, that's not what I was going to point out. Um, well, let's play some chess. In fact, let me join in a tournament, because I haven't done one of those in a while. Uh, hourly Bullet, nope. Hourly Crazy House, where'd it go? Uh, that's not the one I wanted. Let's go to the tournaments and see what's open. Hourly Crazy House, one minute. Okay. Let the madness begin. Oh, I've got to turn down my speakers, but I have no time in which to do so. Uh, are you kidding me? Can I not get a pairing? Please give me a pairing. Can I have a pairing? I'd like an opponent. Can I move yet? Is it my turn? Come on, I'd like a pairing. Anytime now. Just give me an opponent. Bishop takes rook. Bishop takes rook. No! You're supposed to take the rook. I thought you were rated 1782. You're supposed to take pieces. Oh, now you take. I guess maybe the diagonal piece does serve quite well, but hopefully he has other things in pocket to drop on f7 and such. <laughs> or can acquire them to drop on f7. And then rook. No, you don't have a rook. Okay, now you have a rook, but you gave up the defense of f7. Um, pawn f6. Promote. I'm not sure if you promote to a knight or to a queen. Um, rook g8. There we go. Give me an opponent. Uh, I want an opponent. Please, can I have an opponent? Any time now. There we go. We got an opponent. We're ready. Oh, my opponent has gone berserk. Sure, we'll return the favor. Why not? Uh, it's been a while since I've done some of this, so bear with me. Uh, I forgot. Knights are good. Free bishop, if he doesn't take. Free knight. Check. Take this. Go back. Check. Ten. Nine, eight, okay. Well, that was fun. Since you gave Zug a trophy, can you have one? What trophy are you talking about? I'm not a moderator on the site. I'm not the one who's awarding anything. I do try to help keep the peace in the forums sometimes, but uh, definitely I'm not a bot. Alright, 2300. Here, let's go. Uh, can I turtle up somehow? Okay, we'll take there. Prepare for sacking. Uh, okay. No idea what this is about, but we'll play it. If he moves the queen away, I can fork king and rook. Um... Uh-oh, that's not good.
Oops. Um, made in one. Oh, that would have been too easy. Uh, I'll take here and hope that there's something. He's not threatening mate in one, so I can keep taking things. Oops, I'm getting mated. Oh, that's checkmate! I thought I'd just go to F8. My bad. You know, I'm just tending to play in tournaments, so I'm not showing preference toward or against anybody. Ah, oh, that was too bad. I lost to a 2300, which is pretty much what you'd expect. Still, that was a good game. And now I'll wait another, like, five minutes to get an opponent. <laughs> okay. That's fine. I guess there just aren't many people playing in this tournament. You know, I, I, part of the reason I posted that question in the forum is because I knew somebody was eventually going to post it, and so I figured I might as well try to make it somewhat comedic and lighthearted and such. Um, also because uh, Lee Chess just needed to have a policy on that in general. So I was glad to play the victim. Is basically what I'm saying. Just keep taking stuff, keep taking stuff, and look at that soft spot. You suppose we're going to get a queen trade? Okay. Uh, check. Check, check, check. Um, <laughs> check. Back up, threatening knight check. Also, I'm threatening to take here and put a queen there. Also, I'm threatening knight takes b7. Um, so, I should probably retaliate with this check. Uh, I'm going to take here because I don't see what's going on. I'm going to take a knight. And check. Man, that was just getting fun, too. So many pieces, I was so ready to checkmate him. Yeah, no, I'm not at all a moderator on the site by any means or any stretch of the imagination. Just a humble little developer out here. Alright, so. Put some pawns up here. If we had a knight, that'd be kind of cool. Uh, I guess I'm getting a bishop, not a knight. Yeah, just let's repeat this a few times. No objections here. In fact, if we could trade some stuff, that'd be cool too. Okily dokily. Oh. oh, my pieces are kind of off sides here. Fine. Take my bishop. 
or don't. Check. If I had a pawn, that'd be nice. Please place the, no, that's not placing the bishop. Uh, now I got a pawn. I could put it here or there. That looks better. I want to put it there. Just put it here and just promote and just keep taking all the things. Check. 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 Uh, check, maybe? I don't know. Take one of those. Check. Get a queen. Whoops. Gosh darn it. Well, how about that? I need to get a faster mouse, though. Yeah, sorry. Um, it's definitely humbling playing uh, with Atrophy in the audience, because he sees all the things. And here I am just futzing about worrying about my mouse not moving fast enough. <laughs> Um, which really it isn't. You saw how I was struggling with the time scramble there. Wait, I need to get some pieces over here. It's going to play bishop there. Yep, called it. Trade bishops, a nice note. We'll take that. We'll take. I usually play much slower crazy house. I don't know why I roped myself into this tournament. Um, okay, he's gonna put something there. I don't know why I'm doing that. It doesn't even look that good. He's gonna sack here. What? No, buddy. That makes no sense. That, I mean, it was maybe well motivated somehow, but the move itself's pretty awful. Oh, shit. Wait, no, my knight's covering this. I'm okay. Uh, check. Yeah, my knight's still covering g2, so I'm not dead. Oh, of course he'd put the knight on g2. Like the one piece that allows me to mate in one. Okay, fine. Well, that was fun. Play a few more games here. Let's see if I can get that rating over twenty one hundred. Considering I'm at two thousand ninety nine, hopefully that won't take very long. I mean, all I'm just asking is that I win one rating point. Hopefully that's not so challenging. Ah! Of course I get one of the strongest players on the site as my opponent, so... Um, 
See, I'm going to win like 50 points this game. That's basically what I'm saying. Um, either that or I might not win. Oh, crap. I forgot about that. Um, let's go back. <laughs> okay. It's nice to know I didn't lose outright in the opening there. Um, definitely breaking new ground. Yeah, now I'll pin this knight. Okay, if he can castle... Wait, where's the knight going? I don't know. I'm going to take that. Um, uh, okay, I take here, and I attack maybe I don't know what I'm doing um. hmm did I blow it somehow that looks scary well now he's threatening that so now I've kind of forced myself into this So I'm forced to take this and that. If I took with the queen, I get pinned or something. Um, oh, that's no good. Let's see if he knows how to do this. I bet he does. Um, okay, so I can place a piece now. Oh, there's the... Okay, wow, that's clever. Well, let's just show it on the board. Yeah. 20 moves. <laughs> that was easy. Um, sure. Why don't we have a rematch? Hopefully I can pick something slower, more positional, something where I'm not getting clutched out of the opening. But, you know, it only costs one rating point each time I lose. So it's probably worth the lesson. Okay, so pin the knight. If his other knight moves, I hit his bishop. So I'm not sure what's going on here. Okay, d5 makes sense, I think. Um, I still don't want to take that knight. I'll just keep this pin here. There's no reason for me to do anything drastic. Then we hit the bishop. He probably is going to capture. Um, I think this is okay, but I don't know. Like, I'm not sure what he's planning. Okay, so this is what I was thinking as I take there and probably have to step back. I could take the knight. He takes my queen. I check. He goes up. Maybe that works. I take the knight. He takes my queen. I check. He does queen takes and I'm getting mated. It might not work. Um, still, we can add more pressure here. Okay. Get the sense that this is supposed to be useful somehow. Um, so there 
there's a fork. I mean, if he's got very few pieces in pocket, it's difficult for him to hurt me. So... Uh, huh. I'm not sure what to say to that. I think I take and just block. Well, thank goodness there's an increment here, too. Okay, what do I do? I mean, yeah, I could take the knight, I could take the bishop. Or I could just see how many of his pieces I can leave on pre. And maybe my king is safer this way. Okay, what's he threatening? He needs another knight, and I'm holding both knights in hand, so I'm not sure what he's doing. Take a look. Um. Oh. Okay, that's kind of a problem. There goes my king. Uh, we'll check. What's he up to? Oh, there's another rook hanging. I needed to take f6. Um, yeah, that didn't quite work out. <sighs> That's too bad. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, I guess what I did that game was I successfully confused him and myself, but... Um, okay. So... I don't know. E6. It's probably okay. Um, no, don't want to move that. But what else do I move? Fine, we'll push a pawn. That never backfires. Uh, okay, I'll push another pawn. Just leave this immense hole and hope that there's no way to exploit it. Found a target. <laughs> Move my bishop. How bad could that be? <laughs> I sound like him when he plays. Yeah, I could imagine that when you're playing against a strong player, pretty much all of your commentary is just ah. That's all it is. Just. Uh, um, ooh, e, oh. It's 
basically all it is. Okay, we'll move the queen over here. Clearly, I just need to push my pawn to secure these squares. That's the ticket. Sure, let's castle, just to make things fun. not trap my queen. Tactics. They're tricky. There. My queen has made it to safety of some sort. not have any tactics here. I mean, you'd think that having so much in pocket I would have something. Just need to play d4 at an opportune moment and nope, d4 is not happening. Okay. Oh, well, that's not good. Yep, he found it. Ah, okay. I see. I see how it is. <laughs> yeah, I mean. Clearly, with all these pawns around my king, nothing could possibly go wrong. Uh. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Fair enough. I was going to say, I have, like, no idea how to play crazy house openings uh, with black and very minimal idea how to play them with white. So I tend to get really seriously ground down in the opening, regardless what opening I play. Let's refresh this page. Create a game this way. Just because I like this view better. You can see all our tournaments, get to see the latest updates. One of these days I'll make a user script that makes everything work, but whatever. Um, wait, Hourly Crazy House. Well, I'm not going to play the whole thing, but sure. Let's play some. Let's play to get those few rating points. Just count four points, and then we can call it. Here we go, e4. We're gonna sack here. That's the plan. Uh, except our opponent's rated 1862, so maybe he has some idea like of how to defend in Crazy House. 
Or how to attack. Maybe he knows some of that too. Yeah, let's just see if we could threaten some of that. Okay. I wonder if the sack on f7... I mean, there's no reason to sack. Just play this and then take it. Um, sure, he castles, I castle. I can't resist this. In fact, this is the better way to do it. I've done this before. Now his pawn's moved, so I just get the rook. That's not so hard. Usually in chess, you think about that the other way around. You want to do forcing moves and checks. Um, yeah. So I'll take that. And if, huh. I could take here too. And repeat the trick. Unfortunately, this knight does defend things pretty well. Um, Oh, then he does knight d6. So yeah, I have to take this first. Let's see if he does knight takes. <laughs> he does do knight takes. That's rather bold. Um, sure. Because now I've got pawn e6 to follow. My queen covers a lot of the... Oh. I don't have a bishop. Um, yeah, my queen covers a lot of territory here. Uh, if he had a knight, that would be pretty scary. But he doesn't. So... I pretty much just march in and take everything. Um... What's the best way to do that? I mean, I could put a pawn here, king takes, pawn there, king takes, and then fork. But that's not necessary. Um, I do rook check, he blocks. That doesn't cut it. Just do another developing move. There's nothing special about his queen being on the square. Oh, I don't have two pawns. I just had the one. Okay, that's cool. That would have been a better move. Pretty sure I know how to checkmate with two knights, a queen, and a rook. I think I know that one. Oh, he's got the bishop covering that, so maybe I drop the knight here instead. There we go. Plus six rating points, mission accomplished. All right, so that's 2100. Let's see, what's next? Which rating do I want to work on here? Um, yeah, 2102, I made it. Yeah, let's work on bullet. Sure, why not? Is there a bullet going on? In fact, what tournaments are going on? Yeah, let's join in last eight minutes here. See if I can make it to 2100 here as well. Play this one in bullet all the time. Oh, knight takes. There we go. 
and have all the cheese. And remember that this isn't crazy house, so don't try to do any crazy house tactics. Uh, let's do this. Oh, he saw it. Didn't work anyway, but he saw it. Check. Check. Okay. Ah, he was only 31 seconds away from winning that, too. Come on. Let's go back to the tournament. All right. Night takes? Please, night takes. No, this is boring. Why would you not play the fried liver? Come on. Gotta play the fried liver. It's the only fun way to play it. It's like black has no sense of adventure. Walk in and checkmate him. Sure, why not? Okay. Free stuff. And now we just have to not lose. Bo City. All right. Sure, I'll take one of those. All right. Wait. Oh, I made it to 2100. But there's four minutes left, so let's play it out. Oops. That's not how you play bullet. Look at my wood shuffling skill. All right, now for the part where he's supposed to make an effort to try to win the game. Check doesn't quite cut it. Now it might. Eh, 
End games are fun. Although they're much more fun when you're actually winning them. That's too bad. Yeah, yeah. Well, obviously, in Bullet, I did not play that endgame correctly. Um, probably didn't play most of that game correctly. Um, Bishop e3? How long until he plays bishop e3? That's what I want to know. What do I have to do to provoke that move? Um, never mind, he's not going to hang the knight. Uh, would have been fun if he did. Let's... Oh crap, I have to take this. I was going to say let's go win the rook, but um, that's not quite feasible. I just does queen d1. I'm kind of miscalculating and hallucinating all over the place, but whatever. Just play the game. Do the best we can. Unless we can do better. And then we just do better than we can. Alright, so kick the bishop. Pile up everything on that one square, and then take here instead. And then kick the knight. Well, actually, that's a free knight now. I forgot, I'm up like 20 seconds, so I might actually get to checkmate him. Okay, well, I'm three points away from the golden number, but 22 places away from first place, so we're going to skip the award ceremony there. Let's see if I can just... Um, this does... Oh, this does not include standard games. Let me re-add standard to my list of things that I display here. Uh, nope. Nobody's seeking a bullet game. Um, well, there goes my chance at greatness. Next chance is in a few minutes, but whatever. Um, sure, let's play a classic, or let's see, hourly blitz. What's my blitz rating? Is this something worth improving? Sure. 2070. Alright. Let's see if we can get um, a few rating points there, too. Apparently it takes a minute to get a pairing. Who knew? Uh, so who's playing this? Hourly Blitz. Hey, fry noodles. If I beat him, can we say that like fried noodles just got cooked. Or how about if I lose to him? Can I still say that? Admittedly, this pawn push to e5 was horrendous and shouldn't have worked. Um, I didn't realize that until after I pushed e5. But yeah. It's just for those of you wondering at home, was that a good idea? No. No, that was a pretty 
awful idea, although it might work. Um, and the point is that he just takes en passant and I'm dropping all my pieces. Uh, but thankfully that's not what happened. So we do have a game to show. As soon as he moves the knight, we take here, and we take here, and we just take up there, and no, there's nothing more on this diagonal to be taken. Um, but yeah, I think he has to move the knight. Unless he's like considering maybe knight takes f7, but I don't know, man. Or maybe he's just going to let it hang there and in the hopes of generating some counterplay. And just take it. Go back and threaten to take this. Maybe I can induce him to do that and then my bishop can take something. The bishop is really looking forward to a day where it might be able to capture a piece. Alright, he's going to pin me. Or not. Just takes. Uh, I mean, that. It's a possibility. All right, so just wait for his queen to move away, and then, and then it's GG. That's the plan. Just wait for the queen to move. Um. No, he's got. Uh, Okay, yeah, maybe he actually will move the queen now that he's got this discovery here. <laughs> um, I bet he sees this mate in one, though. He might forget. But it's really tempting to try to trap my queen. You know, I'll just, like, march the knight forward, and hopefully my bishop, queen, and all that work together and form a mate. Um... Oh no. Yeah, no. Sog, I'm sorry to hear you have a cold. Um, I did see the last game of your session. It was most entertaining. Um, I say as I capture my opponent's queen and threaten maiden one. Um, by this checkmate. The fact that it took a second to register that that's checkmate uh, caused me to kind of freak out because it always plays that bing noise at the end of the game to let you know that it's over. And uh, my reaction when it failed to play that noise was, oh crap, did I just somehow hang my queen? Um, it It's far too early for a leech to be pulling that stuff on me. Give it a day or two, and it might be time for Lee Chess to pull that kind of nonsense, but today? Really? Okay. Might not want to go Berserk this game. Um, so here we are, playing an open Sicilian. Never mind that I don't know it. Um, so, we're just going to put our game face on and pretend that we know it. That's what they all do, except for the ones who studied it. Um, so I think I just like play this in castle. Maybe f4 and queen f3 or something, I don't know. Get all these lines mixed up, there's just too many for me to remember any one of them. I need to put in some time to really study games and appreciate what in the world's going on in Sicilian. But um, at the same time, I just find endgames fascinating and openings. I just It's not something that I find exciting. Yeah, no, I'm rated 2000 on the site and I, I don't know openings. But man, put me in an endgame and then um, I'll play okay moves.
I can out okay anybody in the end game. No, I, I'm putting some practical challenges here for my opponent, um, I think. So I'm considering e5 and then like dropping my knight over here. Still got rook d1. Um, it's just my plans don't come to fruition nearly as quickly as most players because I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing. Can I do this? No. Tactics do not work. Let's just develop. Hit that. Make him think. Um. Oh, that defends the pawn. That was the disconnect in my mind. It's like, how is this possible? Or how is it okay? Um, so now, theoretically, I said theoretically because I really doubt he's going to do this, but okay, he takes there. He can win a pawn. He wins my e-pawn. But this is not simple at all. I'm not going to trade bishop for knight. I don't want opposite colored bishops in a wide open position like this. Same colored bishops I can maybe take, especially if I, well, here I am playing without a sense of adventure, I admit. Unless I consider like this. Um, hmm. Actually, this wins the pawn back, because he has to play that, and then I've got this pawn. Or he could play e5, and I take e5, and then what? Wait, can I play f5, he takes my bishop, and f6, g6, queen g5, knight c5. This is too interesting to pass up. No, this doesn't work. Um, wait. Wait a second. This just maybe works? I'm not sure. I wasn't going to save this for the post-mortem. That is basically my point. Um, it's too interesting a possibility to not attempt. See, this is what um, makes me think it might actually work. See, but with the queen away from that, I can threaten rook takes knight, right? I mean, am I missing something terribly obvious? Maybe. Oh, that. Okay, so fine. That's okay. Um, I think I'm still fine here. I mean, next logical step is uh, queen h5. And I think he's just taking his time to recalculate and make sure he hasn't missed anything. 
but I think queen h5 seals the deal. Um, I don't think I have any continuation thereafter. I don't understand that move at all. So confused. Surely much has gone on in the side variations that I haven't calculated. Um, because I know the things I'm seeing, I'm just thoroughly convinced none of this is working for me. Um, but he keeps going for really complicated continuations here. Of course I see this, but um, I'm skeptical that this could be the light at the end of the tunnel. I mean, how could this not be just an oncoming train at this point? Um, Oh, crap. <laughs> you got me. Okay, that was a really weird game. What happened this game? Uh, okay, first of all, the opening. So we got the pulse in Sicilian. Um, maybe I should just go against the master database. I mean, Bishop B2 has been played before. I admit, I've like, what I'm playing is based on what I think I remember, and not based on any theoretical understanding. Um, so, I, at some point, I actually need to study and try to understand these moves, as opposed to just playing from memory. Um, yeah, after c5, I was out of my memory. Um, I played queen d3, which is okay. Uh, prefer moves queen c4. It's a little bit more active, but uh, and yeah, after castles, we're out of book, and I just bring it to him, and then yeah, let's run the computer analysis on some of this because there's just so many tactics. Um, yeah, no, basically, I think tactically, I just went down a pawn and tried to justify it, and I have no idea. Yeah, I don't know. P opinions will differ. At one point, it was okay. Um, the coolest thing would be if somehow this actually did work. Uh, that would be awesome. Plus 2.3. Guys, the sack works. Oh yeah, this is going in my... Uh, bookmarked games library. I don't claim I played it right, but holy moly, it's incredible that not only does it work, but Stockfish recognizes that it works. Which, okay, uh, that's where it failed here was um, I had to just play Queen H6 here. I saw Knight E6. How do elaborate, Stockfish. You can't just say, oh yeah, just play the queen there. It's all fine. Don't worry about it. We got this. You can't just do that to me, Stockfish. That's not cool. Um, like, I don't know. 
now do I take the pawn? No, because I get pinned. 